guys happy friday i hope you guys are having a great day or at least it's friday for me i think this video is going to go up on a saturday but i'm really excited because if you saw my last video you'd know me and juan we're taking a little bit of an extended weekend and we're leaving town staying at a hotel doing some shopping um and then woody he's staying at his doggy daycare which normally he stays with my mom but we figured we'd give her a break we're gonna leave here shortly i just got out of the shower one shine right now and i'm doing my makeup we're only gonna be gone for two nights and three days so it's gonna be really short and we're only staying an hour from home we need to go shop for some loungewear which was our original plan because we just want to stop wearing like our old clothes basically all my clothes is like from high school or a year after high school so i thought that it was a nice time to kind of freshen up the wardrobe good excuse to go shopping and then if you saw my last video or if you follow me on instagram you would have seen um some flowers that one got me i told you guys that we had some big news and i am so excited to share it with you guys and to be like completely transparent it was actually a goal that i had set out for myself last year and it just didn't end up working out it wasn't in the cards for me but god always has a better plan and it's always at the perfect timing and i'm so 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 excited for this new adventure but i got a promotion at work i'm so so excited this is something like i said i've been praying about for so so long it was one of my goals and something that i knew i wanted ever since starting at the company that i work with i'll have the opportunity to work from home four days a week which is awesome i start august or not august april 10th which is only a week and a few days away from today which is so so exciting so i'm also going to be shopping for a few more pieces for work i already work in an office setting so it's not that i need things but it's always exciting of course to like shop for a new milestone and we're already going to go shopping so yeah we're going to pick up some stuff just you know spruce up the work get excited celebrate a little bit so yeah that was the big news i had a couple people dm me um what the news was when i posted the flowers on instagram and of course i just told them i i just had to i was so so excited but yeah wish me luck so we're gonna be heading out here probably within the next hour i still need to pack the stuff that i'm gonna take and then we'll have to like pack up woody's things and his food um, we're going to drop him off at his daycare first and then we're going to pick up some salads from Chick-fil-A and then we're going to hit the road. I will update you guys once we get to the hotel probably and I just thought it would be fun to take you guys along with me especially since I'm going to be doing some shopping. I'll definitely show you guys what I pick up. Like I said we're getting a bunch of loungewear and I'll probably just pick up a couple pieces of work clothes i'm probably gonna pick up one or two pairs of shoes i also forgot to mention don't forget to subscribe of course it honestly kind of shocks me <laughs> to be honest that my subscribers are always going up because i have been so inconsistent the past month and i'm trying to get back on it but i honestly feel like i'm always saying that now we'll see you guys here in a little bit All right guys, so we just got to our hotel room. We have stayed in this hotel before and our room looked exactly like this last time too, which I'm okay with because I love the room. It's so cozy. So over here, there's a microwave and a um, refrigerator in there. There's some coffee cups. And then over here, there's a nice little lounge area, the sofa. And I just found out that it actually pulls out down here to make another bed, which is super cool. Over here, there's a little desk area as well which I'm not sure if I'll even be using that but it's really cute super cozy and then over here there's a TV and the mount does move so you can point it over here at the lounger or over there when you're on the bed which is super cool and then there's a nice little mirror on the closet and in the closet we already have our suitcase in there we just shared the giant one it's just of the parking lot to be quite honest but I think last time we stayed it just pointed to the back of the building so we get to see what's going on in the front over here is the bathroom just pretty standard toilet there's no bath um, but there's a shower and then I love the mirror because when you're showering this part 
in the square. It doesn't fog up, which is super cool. But yeah, that's the room tour. We're about to head out on the town and go to our house and look at some furniture. Hey guys, so we just got back to the hotel. It's about 9.15. Already did some shopping for tonight. We went to two different malls and found a good amount of stuff already. Not everything, but it was definitely a good start. And we got some takeout from Flame Burger. We've never been here before, but it was recommended by like an Instagram food food blogger that I follow on Instagram that lives in Indy. So we're really excited to try. I'll show you guys, but we decided to get a drink from a gas station instead of from the restaurant just because it would be cheaper just a fountain drink and the guy gave it to us for free which was so so nice totally made my night that was so kind of him i'll show you guys what we got tomorrow because we're just tired hungry we're gonna just chill out and watch a movie on the bed while we eat our dinner and yeah it was a pretty successful day i would say so I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right guys, this is our dinner for tonight. It smells so, so, so good. So these are the flame queso fries, which is fries, bacon, and cheese on the side. And I think one of those may be ranch. I may be wrong. Mine is called the Indie Burger. It just has the regular fixings with lettuce, tomato, pickle, and onion, um, and cheese on it, of course. And I got a brioche bun. And then one, he has the flame burger, and he also just got regular toppings on there. And there's also um, bacon on there as well. So we're gonna dig in. Good morning guys, it's Saturday and I have to apologize ahead of time because the lighting is a little bit wonky. I'm literally right in front of the window and the sun is like coming in and out because of all the clouds. Last night it was so so rainy, there were tornadoes everywhere, there's been a lot of damage done which one, he kept looking at the weather all night last night because it was just so bad it was quite a pretty view from the hotel it was like so relaxing and calming i love the sound of like rain and thunderstorms and like white noise in general um but it was like kind of scary like even like all over my for you page on tiktok there were so many like videos of the damage that's been done which is so so sad but luckily me and Juan, we were safe anyways i wanted to do a little haul for what we've gotten so far we went to four different or we went to a lot of stores yesterday but we shopped from four different stores we're about to leave to do some more shopping but there's a couple returns i have to make because we went to h&m and their fitting rooms were not in service so i couldn't try on what i picked out and i would have tried on more stuff but i didn't just want to buy a whole bunch of stuff and then return a whole bunch of stuff so i picked up some stuff from h&m some of it worked some of it didn't so i just wanted to show you guys everything let's get into the haul i'm gonna start off with h m because that's the place i was most excited to go to and i'm quite sad that the changing rooms are down because i know i would have done more damage but here's our bag like i said me and one both got stuff so i'll just show you guys both the first two things i'll show you are actually the two things that i'm returning from h m they're actually both the same dress but different styles i got them in a medium i just didn't like how it looked on me the cut is something that i normally wouldn't wear i'm not sure if you can tell but it's like a v like a deeper v and then the sleeves are kind of like belled which is also something that i normally wouldn't do but it's really 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 pretty but on me i just I don't know i wasn't really a big fan but the pattern is so 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 cute same thing with the other one same style but it's like a creamy beige color it's also like a very like wrinkle prone material which a lot of things at h&m are like that but i thought it was so so pretty um but yeah didn't work for me so we're returning 
both of these. It was $34.99 each. So we'll get about 70 bucks back, which is 70 bucks that I can spend today, but I'm sad they didn't work out. Right next from H&M is another dress. I love wearing dresses to work when it's nice outside because it's so easy to just throw on. You don't have to worry about pants or like a cardigan or anything but it's a short sleeve kind of like zebra print dress also with like a pretty cut it's not as deep and dramatic as the other one it's just super casual i should be trying these on but you get the point it's just like a really pretty kind of like t-shirt dress but like really nice material super soft super flowy this one was $24.99 my last piece that i got from h&m is that same style dress but in a different print i don't own anything green like this but one really liked it because my eyes are green and he said it would make my eyes pop so he approved of this one i was kind of on the fence about it with the color but the cut is just like the other one i tried it on when i got to the hotel and then everything else from H&M is also ones, but I wanted to tell you guys a little trick that we did yesterday. Juan was picking up a cologne from Macy's and he was like trying out a whole bunch of different ones. And all of the cards that we sprayed on, we kept and just put them into the H&M bag. Um, that way the clothes would smell like the cologne and it, oh, it smells so wonderful in here. So if you're ever like at the perfume counter trying out stuff, just toss them in your bag so that your items smell good. Go through one stuff really fast but one he also was shopping like in mind of like a vacation because we're going to Florida in June and then also we're planning on going to Hawaii in next January so in his mind he was thinking about like vacation vibes and like soft flowy like beach shirts so he picked up this really pretty um button up shirt he tried this on when he got home and it looked so so good i love this style of shirt on him but like not buttoned all the way up to the top i like it like with one or two buttons off or just like completely open and this one was 17.99 so not bad and then one he just picked up some basics for like loungewear and for just being around the house and going out because i told him that he needs to get like a little bit more of a capsule wardrobe that goes with many things versus like i don't know some of the things that he has like can only be worn with like certain stuff so he has a lot of clothes but like not everything is like wearable as often so he picked up some really cute basics so i found this gray t-shirt really soft um he doesn't have anything in this color and i thought it would look really cute with like basically all of the shorts that he has and it was only 6.99 and same thing he has lots of like black tees but you always need more as a guy as a guy so got another black basic and then he also has a lot of these really cute cotton shorts but he doesn't have this color i spotted it i'm such a like neutral girly when it comes to like men's clothes so i spotted this he loved the color i loved the color and then another cute super universal color is this brown taupey color i love this this one is my favorite find of all this is the first thing that i spotted it's like black and white vertical striped tee it's super super flowy and lightweight and one looks so good in these style of shirts um and it's just super like vacation-y summer break uh i don't know i just love it so it was only 17.99 such a steal and i don't know it's like pretty basic and would go with like a lot of different occasions and colors and styles you can dress it up dress down um but yeah this one's super cute i love it so we went to the macy's counter for one's cologne and he sniffed a bunch of them he already kind of had an idea of which ones he wanted and he ended up going with the ysl cologne which smells so so good 134.61 for this bottle they only had one size um but one he's not one to like spray cologne like a crazy amount especially if it's strong like this um so i'm sure this is gonna last him for a long time and i definitely think investing in good quality like fragrance is worth it i love when someone smells good and you just get so many compliments on it and then speaking of fragrance i also got a couple perfume victoria's secret perfume is like one of my og like favorite like perfumes to always get i've had almost 
all of them i was having such a hard time picking like which ones i wanted um but i did land on two and i also got a roller ball so the first one that i got is the classic bombshell one it's still in the packaging i'm sure you guys have smelled this somewhere because it's such a classic it was 79.95 which isn't terrible i me personally i'm one that if i put on perfume i put on like 25 sprays so it doesn't last as long as it does with one um so i try to not go like entirely too crazy which which kind of perfumes i like another one that i landed on which used to be one of my favorites as well was the very sexy the red one they also have a black one um this one smells so good so elegant so romantic and also is one that lasts four days i love how these um victoria's secret perfumes always linger on your clothes even after you shower you can still smell them on you which is something that i really love this one was the same price 79.95 um and these are the bigger bottles and then last but not least i also picked up a roller ball i was on the fence on if i wanted um the full size of this one because it's all of them just smelled so nostalgic to me because i'm telling you it's what I used to always wear in high school, right after high school, and then I kind of just stopped and had different ones that my mom would always give me, like the Michael Kors ones, and just ones from Ulta that like I had never tried before. And then I was just having a hard time picking, so I picked up a rollerball, the Love Scent. Oh my gosh, it smells so, so good. And then the last place I picked up some clothes at was Rose and Remington. I've actually never been there before, and they had so many cute pieces and then the pieces that i got were actually both on sale like i think they were on the clearance rack but they were such good finds so i got this like blocked color block cardigan cream and like a burgundy color like a light burgundy pink so pretty i love the back and it's kind of cropped as well and i know it's about to be summertime or springtime hotter than it is now um but i thought it'd be really cute like as a transitional piece like with shorts or i don't know i'll figure out a way to wear this but i love the color it's so soft and i love when the sleeves are not like up here i believe it was 70 percent off and the original price is $45.99 so I couldn't say no. I think my favorite piece that I picked up on the entire trip was this really pretty soft sweater mock neck. Oh my gosh it's so pretty and so soft. I've never had like a turtleneck mock neck before and I've always wanted one. I wanted to try it on and it is so flattering so pretty originally $49.95 and it was 70% off so I had to have it it's also like kind of cropped it kind of goes like right up to my waistline um so it's not too too cropped it would work with like jeans or like pants definitely not leggings but it's so pretty sorry I'm really bad at describing clothes you guys know I love neutrals if you've seen my house you know I love neutrals um and I don't know it looks really good with my skin tone so I thought this would be like a really pretty work piece or like church piece or really whatever I want and then last thing I got from Rose and Remington was a jewelry piece all right this is what it looks like it's all on one chain but there's three different styles on there which I love because it's just a lot easier to wear that way um this was $18.99 not on sale so paid full price for this one but it's so pretty the discount on this was sixty dollars and 48 cents it would have been 111 um so less than half so i'm happy about that like i said we're gonna do some more shopping today so i'll probably show you guys that tomorrow once i get home but yeah we're about to leave go get some coffee gonna go to target because i feel like they'd have really good loungewear um and yeah we'll see wherever else the day takes us
All right, guys, so it's Sunday afternoon. We've been home for a couple hours now, just doing some housekeeping. Haven't picked up Woody yet, but I wanted to wrap up the video by showing you guys what I ended up picking up yesterday. We went to Target, and honestly, that's what I love because I could just pick up the rest of everything else that I needed. I don't really like doing a lot of in-person shopping, so just going to the mall and going to a ton of stores honestly isn't really my thing. So I loved going to Target and just picking up like everything else that I needed. One, we still went to the mall and we did a bunch of other shopping for him, like at, you know, more sports stores for him, I guess. Um, so I'll just show you guys the rest of what I got because if I show you guys what we got for him too, we'll be here forever. We also went to Ulta. And I'll show you guys that in another video, but one got another clone from there and I also picked up like some more makeup that I needed because it seems like anytime I run out of my makeup, it's always all at once and I have to pick up like a ton of stuff. So I'll show you guys that in another video. Okay guys, let's just start with the shoes. I laid them out all on the couch here to show you guys. Um, but this is the first pair I got. One, he really loved these for me. He said that they remind him of like a beach day. I picked these up in an eight and a half. These two, oh my gosh, so pretty. This kind of reminds me of like a Mexican crochet. Which they're both the same style, but in different colors. And I got them in a nine and a half. I don't I don't know if you guys are the same way but for my clothes and shoes i never just get one size they're different so like this one's an eight and a half this one's a nine and a half that one's a nine one of these is a ten like all of my shoes and clothes are always different sizes um but i got these both in a nine and a half and they fit so so nicely and then i got these braided little strap heels which are so so cute i have seen these like in the years past and i've always wanted to get them but i just never did so i thought starting a new job this would be perfect and we have like five weddings to go to this year so i think this is bound to go with one of my outfits and then lastly i got these cute little black loafers they're pointed crocheted i thought these would be really cute for work because they cover my toes um so yeah these nice little flat loafers are super comfortable and then they were only 25 bucks as well all right and the rest of the clothes that i got like i said did end up being from target but i got these cute little kind of reminds me of zebra print flowy little shorts whether they're for like lounging around or for vacation i thought they'd be so pretty and then I got a couple tank tops. I got this one in an extra, extra large because I like when they fit nice and flowy, but I love this camel color. Same thing, I got same style, different color, and I got it in an extra large instead of an extra, extra large. And then I got a couple of these little camis in different colors. So this one is kind of like a mustard yellow or orange color. I got the same kind of idea with this white tank top. I really like the v-neck. And again, I got this one in an extra large because I thought it'd look really cute flowy, especially for the summer. And then same cami, different print. So this one's just black and white and like little heart spots, which is so adorable. And call me crazy, but when I was trying it on in the changing room, I tried it on with these like tan zebra print shorts and i thought they were so cute together even though they're different colors and different prints i thought they looked so cute so it's definitely a vision and then last but not least same cami gone in a large and a black because black goes good with everything last thing were these shorts because like i said i was shopping for loungewear i feel like maybe i didn't hit the nail on the head but i got these lounge shorts i got them in a medium super soft okay guys that's it for today video thanks for spending the weekend with me i had so much fun i'm really tired um there's some stuff that we need to do at the house before tomorrow obviously with the start of the work week um so i'm gonna wrap up the video here like i said we still need to pick up woody um probably do our grocery shopping which i really don't want to do but without further ado i'll see you guys in the next video bye guys